Hello and welcome back to Rugby Fit. I'm Greg O'Shea and we're trying to find out what rugby's most gruelling fitness session is. We're here in Chiswick Rugby Club and it's a beautiful day. And before we find out what I'm do actually doing today, let's meet today's guest. Hi, I'm Lauren Jumps. I started skipping at the start of lockdown and I haven't looked back. Having never skipped before, I now have over 700,000 followers across Instagram and TikTok. Oh, that is so impressive. Oh my God, how are you getting on? Yeah, not bad, thanks. So tell me, the skipping, I'm honestly so impressed by it. How did you start into it? You're a viral sensation. Basically, I got furloughed in lockdown. I saw a couple of people doing all these tricks on Instagram, and I just decided to give it a go. First time picking up a rope? First time picking up a rope. I find that so hard to believe with how good you are. <laughs> wow. I know. Yeah, I'm not exactly sure what they have in store for us, but I know it's going to be something horrible within these four white uh, lines. So we find out what they have in store? Yeah. Should we see what Jasmine Joyce has to say? Hi guys, it's Jasmine Joyce here. In training for the Olympics and GB7s, and in my 15s career with Wales and Bristol, we're put through vigorous fitness programs, and one session that stands out for me is the Bronco. The session is simple. There are four cones, the start line, 20, 40, and 60 meters. You must start on the try line and run to the 60 meter mark, then back to the try line. You then immediately turn and run to the 40 and back, and the, then the 20 and back. That counts as one rep. To complete the exercise, you must do five reps. The best time I have ever done a Bronco in is five minutes and four seconds. However, one of my teammates did it in four minutes and 45 seconds. And Ireland's Hugo Keenan has recorded a four minute and 11 seconds Bronco. So no pressure to either of you. Good luck guys and remember full commitment and go and enjoy it. So, the Bronco test, you ever done one of them before? No. They are sick. It's <laughs> tough now, but you gotta pace yourself. I've done a few in my time. My best time ever, I think is 4.24. I've been out of practice now for a couple of months, so if I go sub five minutes, I'll be happy as well. I'm not gonna know how to pace myself. I don't <laughs> even do any running. So we're gonna have to do it one after the other, and I would say ladies go first, but we can rock over scissor fit if you want. Let's do that, go for Okay, it. so on three. One, two, three. One, two, three. Yeah! Oh. <laughs> All right, Lauren, Brilliant. you're up first. Best of luck. Let's do this. I've never done anything like this before. I've no idea how to pace myself or anything like that. I'm gonna have to see how it goes and hope for the best. All right, Lauren, you ready? No. <laughs> do you know what you're doing? You remember oh, I've got Ladybird on me. Actually, the way I've always done it with the Irish rugby team is we do 20 out, 40 out, 60 out. So it kind of makes sense to do the first cone first. Jasmine might do it the other way around, but at the end of the day, you end up doing the same distance. So I think that's the way we should do it. All right, so sub six minutes is the target. Okay, we're going in three, two, one. Let's go! Yeah, pace yourself. Good stuff. First 60 meters. Try it out, good stuff, Lauren. Brilliant, nearly done your first rep. First rep was done in one minute, 13 seconds. That's okay, we're gonna build into it. I like that you're up turning on alternate legs as well. <laughs> Balance out the workload. That's the two minute mark. You're gonna start hitting the pain cave right about now, I'd say, rep two and three. <laughs> Questionable whether you hit the line there. <laughs> Third 60 meters, you're on three minutes now. Brilliant, Lauren, well done, I'm proud of you. Just keep breathing, keep that pace. That's four reps in 4.42. Last rep. You are looking fresh for someone in the middle of a Bronco. <laughs> you're on track to break six minutes. Keep going. Last 60 out and back. Go on, see it off. Go. Get in there. Get in under six minutes. Keep going. Woo -hoo -hoo. Go on. Yes. By 40. Unreal. Uh. Yes. Oh my God, I'm so proud of you. Well done. Uh. Unreal. You look yeah. so fresh as well. 540. You yeah, smashed right. your target. Yeah. yeah. What, Jasmine Joyce did 504, you did 540 and you don't do running ever. If I did it again, I'd know better how to pace myself. But I'm really happy with that for the first attempt. Um, considering I haven't done any running in ages. Alright, I think it's my turn now, is it? 
Yeah, yeah. and it's funny energy to cheer you on now. That was great going. I just hope I don't make a fool of myself. It's been a while. Last time I trained hard was in the build up to the Olympics. Oh, I'm nervous. Come on, Greg. Right. Three, two, one. Let's go. Turn us how it's done with those turns. <laughs> Come on, nearly halfway there. So you're at 206 at your halfway point. Go, 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 go! We're on time, so dig deep, see if you can get an even better time. 3.34. Just past four minutes. Come on, Greg, last push. As hard as you can. Go, Greg, push, 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 push. Go, 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 go! Yeah. Ah. Woo! Jesus! Ah. What did I get? Look at that. What did I do? 426. Woo, a baby! That yes! Was That's two seconds off my best. Oh my god. Okay. 425, 56. I'm taking 425. Yeah, I'm in. Yes. One second off my best. I beat my target at 445. I am in bits though. Well done. Well done. Good stuff. Okay, so ranking it on the rank scale between one and 10. 10 being the most grueling session ever done in my life. One being nothing. What would you say? First time you did it, I think you could have gone harder from the start. I could have gone hard, dog. Seven, eight out of ten. Okay, we've got 7.5 for you? Yeah, 7.5. 7.5, 7 and you could have gone harder. Yeah. I just know how sore Broncos are. I'm going to give that a 9 out of 10. Just, I, like, I'm not falling in the ground, so obviously there's still a little bit left in me, so that's why it's not a 10, but 9 out of 10, yeah. Bronco, don't try this at home. <laughs> okay, that's it for this episode of Rugby Fit. If you liked the video, please, please press the like button, and also please press the subscribe button, because we have a lot more content coming your way. Lauren, thanks so much for joining me. Thanks. Follow Lauren on Instagram and TikTok. Her skipping lessons are unbelievable. I can't wait to do some more. I'll catch you next time. Thanks very much.